Hey everybody, welcome back to another game at all.com co-op. I'm Luke Scrim. And I'm Pendivus. We're back with River City Ransom Underground. Where we last left off, we were about to uh, run into a gang trouble. We were about to get uh, our shit handed to us here. So let's see that it's not gonna happen. Oh god! Oh, they're running away. Good. They were scared of us. They're stronger than we realized. Oh, you okay, go Yes, you can. You just have to uh, jump. Ah, ah! But we are on their turf. I mean, they're warlocks, right? They're in the sewer, that's normal, right? Ultimately, they're the emoists of the emo kids. This is all part of our play. Cut off! <laughs> <laughs> More depressed image. Ah! And this is like, well, we're fucked. What a strange place to put this. So... If only uh, I was a master of lockpick. Yep. Did, did we just... We just jumped into the sewer and went through a warp pipe. See, warp pipes. I always want to do that. <laughs> and then, look whose garage we landed in. Look what just crawled out of the sewer. You must be the reason the city gangs are on the rampage. Otherwise, you'd have used the door. You don't look like the kidnapping type. Wait, we didn't do anything. What's worse, we had to swim in an ocean of sewage to escape just about everybody. Don't sweat it. We know what's really going on. People are going missing in River City and nobody's demanding a thing? This has Slick's name all over it. What if the gang's thirsty for Merv's reward money and stuff, blah 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 blah, whatever. <laughs> Never met the man, he seems grumpy. We got one! One of the beat runners was spotted near the freeway! Those creeps are well connected! Oh! <laughs> they could beat us somewhere. Okay, we got a plan. Sting a bee, chase the lead. You come with us if you want. You gotta figure out which one's, like, ah. who's doing the voices of who. <laughs> voices are overrated. Aha! All these cars and they still walk everywhere. So. Yep. We got a fancy bike, which... It's like the Akira bike, right? Oh yeah, it's definitely. Yeah, and then, you know... I see where they get for it. They got another car up there. You can even pick up the tire and fight with it. Whoa! Okay, so we can hurt ourselves with tires. That's good to know. Alright, we're both about to die. Let's do this. Oh yeah, we have an inventory system. Like right now you're holding can of pop. And you can use one of the triggers to use it. There we go. Karma Jolt. Oak and seed. So it's beer. What's kind of cool is sometimes they'll just NPC help you, or sometimes you just die like me because I'm a, I'm a chump. Mama. At the start of the game, you die constantly. Uh, your character is just me. You could be forever. Safe enough thought in the game to just not die all the time. I need to change my underpants. <laughs> the line, the uh, classic line, barf is still in the game. Good. I mean, you have to. Also, whenever I see these kind of like slicks, I just keep thinking Homer Simpson. But yes, like every type of uh, enemy has a different style. Like the uh, those slits will just taunt and fight like bruisers. While if you, like the one you're fighting right now, which is more like hobo, will fight dirty, like toss some sand in your face and stuff. Nice. And like the one that's on the ground right in front of me he is a wrestler, so he'll do like grappling tri tricks and stuff like that. He's a luchador. They 
always start you behind the cars for this area. And uh, it's really hard to see. Oh god, a Bobo's here. What? Oh shit. A Bobo can just randomly spawn. the Bobo. He gives a lot of money. Awesome. Fuck, I kinda wanna play as Ryan and Alex, man. They <laughs> you can after this segment, actually. When I beat it solo, I had to play as... Whichever one of the blue ones is Ryan. Because he played exactly like the old games. So I was used to that moveset and everything. Yeah. So that's why I played as him. And it made the game far easier. But you have to unlock them and play the characters first, right? Yeah. Like, I know it's a sad thing that we can't get Scott Pilgrim vs. The World anymore, as it's got pulled for licensing issues, right? But if you ever have the urge of playing that game, just buy this instead. It's, yeah, it's pretty much exactly the same. It's just better. It's... Okay, it doesn't have the sweet Anime Noguchi music. Mm. But, as far as gameplay goes, this is much better in my opinion. And see? One of the Luchador wrestlers that we have to catch up. One of the PG brothers. Also, I enjoy how you learn move in this game much better than the previous ones. Instead of learning them from magazines as you did in the other ones, you learn them from dojos. Of course. So you visit random dojos through the game, and you get stuff. Ooh, the cat shop is open! Oh, we can't go in it yet because we're in the mission. Uh, I haven't figured out what they do, but you have hideouts all over the map, right? Yeah. And if you buy a cat, it shows up in the hideout. But I don't know what else it does. <laughs> Probably was just beating him with his box, with her box. You just killed me. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. You just made me lose half of my money. You're almost dead as well. But be careful. I just won't pick up the box. Ah. Getting hit by the box that slides will also kill you. What? Oh. This is the last hideout we visited. So have all our like XP at least. We keep the XP. We lose half our money. Oh, that makes sense. Whenever you die, it's automatically lose half money. <laughs> With four on one, that guy has no chance. Watch out! Kicks all our asses. With the enemy, sometimes, yeah. Haha, <laughs> you did the old school thing of running into the invisible wall. Ah. I love grapples. Like, if I grapple and just start uppercutting them. <laughs> and my grapple is a punch to the nuts. Aww. Ooh. My grapple with a kick button is just straight punch. Gee, I didn't check the kick button. Grab that grapple. Why'd you toss it straight at me? Hey, you got in the way. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay, we made a point. Point made? 
fight me. <laughs> so apparently, your big punch grapple thing can also hurt me as well. Interesting. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you're not enemies. Yeah, you guys are fine. <laughs> I lied and say you fought bravely. Nice. Who was that? That was one of the bad guys. He <laughs> ran off and saying that lie and say I fought bravely. <laughs> oh, that's great. I love this. Nightfall! What a horrible time for this cursed night! Ah, uh, Castlevania 2. <laughs> uh, I feel like that's the only game that I really don't want to have referenced ever. Come on! It was so bad that it was good. No, no, it was just so bad. Yeah. Why are we fighting them behind that pole? Like, it's the one place we don't have vision. I have a pipe and I get to bash me. Fine, I'll get back. the baseball back. Oh yes, there is civilians. If you beat them, they will call the cops. So, it's a good thing not to beat the civilians. That guy's a freak! Yeah, <laughs> I was like, listen here, businessman, you wanna you wanna throw down? Yes. Uh the enemy categories are very obvious. We've seen most of the different type of enemies so far. Yeah. But yeah. It's better than just slaves. Okay, we're gonna <laughs> Cheese of <laughs> All right, so we got a point of where to go. I don't remember that being a thing. Oh, it's to hide from the cops. So, yes. It gave us the screen as we just got Ryan and Alex. Classic. Oh, I'm going with Alex. You're going with Alex? Yeah. Don't want to replay the game through with Ryan. Hey, it's Old Man Logan. <laughs> uh, I might give the Shotokan a try. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. Alex seems like exactly how I would play. And know what's the best? We still haven't unlocked all the characters. Oh! Elbow to the back of the head. Like, the game's already got a decent roster. Yeah. But there's even more characters to unlock. And this is one of the examples of the dojos. And notice on the back there's the Castle Crasher guys and stuff. <laughs> yeah, you just come and talk and uh, get to buy new moves if you have money, which none of us do. No, because we swap characters. Yup. Might after this, though. I might, because I've just been taking all your money. Uh. I died. I have no sense of HP. That looks like I failed to tickle and was upset about it. 
Like when you go to grapple and miss. Yes. And he's all like, oh. What's even more sad is you can fist bump. But if you're alone, there's nobody to fist bump with, so you have to cancel the fist bump, and he just looks shattered. Like, as if the whole world fell apart around him. Oh, that looked like it. Oh. Yes, I love it. I think my bowels have loosened. That was amazing. Well, you definitely don't have enough. No. I know out of the other characters that we're missing, there's one that is Muay Thai. Nice. And there's a chick on rollerblades. Classic throw to uh Sweet of Rage. Rage. Yeah, push R3. Fizz bump! Yeah! But see if you don't come. <laughs> Pure sadness. <laughs> <laughs> We both had the same idea. Well, this is where we need to go anyway. Oh. Uh, if you break too many arcades, the cops will get called and stuff. So... Let's try this. As fun as it is to just destroy everything... It has a reason not to. Yes. There we go! Oh. Oh, sweet. <laughs> but see, that's all I mean when you can just grab and hold someone for the other player. Wild West Schmuck. For real Zines, no fighting. We're in nerds there. Of course the arcade's the nerds. Oh wait, where am I? I had confused for a moment was uh, looking at you as my character. I'm like, not my What's going on? Oh, I was like, what's making that noise? And do we people talking? Oh. Yeah, I thought it was your phone, right? Yeah. I was so confused. Alright. Let's admire the detail of that Captain Black... Turtles? Mini call? <laughs> uh, so they put a lot of details in the environment for this game. That looks like the fucking turtle. Definitely does. Uh, this game is full of 80s throwback. And this is just the start of it. 80s and 90s, it's a pop culture reference. Awesome. And with that, we'll see more on the next Damn it! <laughs>